Alright, so I decided I wanted to make a swash leveling tool. Took out the lathe and two millimeter hole reamed out down the center. Relieved in the center just so there's no interference on the swash. It's about 19 millimeters in diameter. Uh, the 4G6 or actually V120 micro heli swash is a little bit larger than the stock Wakara one, so I made it to fit the largest diameter swash. Um, haven't got a milling machine just yet, that's next on my purchase list, but in the meantime, the lathe just made it round, so I haven't been able to cut it out into like a triangular type shape, like a normal swash leveling tool. Anyhow, let me fire up the Micro Beast. Plug it in. And as it initializes, you'll see it pitch pump. Okay, put the tool on. Okay, and let me s flip the controller into throttle hold where I've got a 0 to 100 curve. See if I can focus in on the links there. And as I cycle it, you'll see just down at the bottom, there's a little bit of a gap on the elevator servo. Everywhere else through the range, it is now perfectly level. And that elevator servo is going to drive me nuts. But at this point, with the Micro Beast, there is no way to adjust the travel limits with uh, endpoints or anything like that, like you normally do in a regular mechanical CP CCPM setup. Um, doesn't matter much because in flight the system will level things out. So, bit of interaction there. Otherwise, uh, all others are pretty much dead nuts. And uh, there we go, now it's in focus. Oop. You can see the elevator servo just down at the bottom of the travel gives you that little bit of play. But everywhere else through the range looks like it's pretty much dead nuts. Um, if I really wanted to, I could dial that out with a prog mix uh, type function. But like I said, with the Micro B system, that's not going to be much of a concern. Other than that, MicroB system seems to be working really well in this machine.